More mighty else. Let's start with Blood Allegiance and Moment of Silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Happy birthday today to Rachel Strickland and Miss Roden. Sports today, we have boys and girls basketball practice and cheer at 415 and we have boys soccer tryouts. The answer to yesterday's trivia question was the 13th Amendment. Today's trivia question is, who became the first black cabinet member of a United States president? For the black history trivia questions, please write your name and answer to each question neatly and turn your answer into the library daily. If your answer is correct, your name may be selected for a prize. We are hosting a mental health day on Friday, February 11th. Fifth and sixth grades will attend three sessions Friday morning, 7th and 8th grades will attend three sessions Friday afternoon. This is an exciting opportunity to learn about ways to support your mental health at home and at school. If you have any questions, please see Dr. Carter. All Tuesday Encore classes will meet on Wednesday this week. GSA meets tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. in room 116. Want to go to the Hillwood basketball game this Friday? Our basketball players and cheerleaders will be recognized. You will receive your free ticket this Friday during 7th period. See the flyers for more details. Track will start on Monday, February 14th. You will not be able to participate until all of your paperwork is turned in. Talk to Ms. Weber if you don't know what you're missing. Sessions with Swine. Swine. Good morning. Hello, everybody. Welcome to this session with Swai, where we talk about being a community in pursuit of excellence. Let's get into it right away. Some great news. Maybe you guys know or don't know. We now have a drama club here at Bellevue. It meets on Thursday afternoons in the auditorium. Uh, very excited to see that get started. So if you want to join, it's not too late. Uh, be sure you stop by on Thursday afternoons uh, to participate in that awesome club. Some other good news, and this is some big news. I want to congratulate the members who have been named to the Student Advisory Council. Uh, and I will list their names here on the screen as well as I read them. So for fifth grade, we have Elliot Chaplin, Gavin Guerriere, and Nancy Q. For sixth grade, we have Reese Foster, Todd Ednicott, and Zykeela Barnes. For seventh grade, we have Griffin Moreno, Durham Grubb, and Michael Hilton. And for eighth grade, we have Liliana Guerriere, Dakaria King, and Hamza Albuni. That is an excellent selection of students for this council. I am so excited to start working with them to hear the student voice through them. Um, so we can make our community even better going forward. I'm excited to have this missing piece of student voice. Um, students, I will be in touch with you very soon about our first meeting 
and then we will get rolling. Now into our IB concept, want to talk about communities. Switching to a new one this week, talking about the concept of communities and how many different ways we can think about that. We can think about communities from just a little group of friends that you have, maybe your school, maybe your city, maybe your state, your country. Maybe it's a community of people who have a very key similarity amongst them, maybe a similar interest. You can also think about communities like ecosystems where they live in the same place and they depend on each other for their life going forward. So communities will show up in a lot of different ways. If you look for it, it's a very powerful and interesting concept that I want you guys to look for. Finally, let's get into being excellent. How can we be excellent? Now I want to focus on the little things. Do you say please and thank you to your friends and to your teachers when they do nice things for you? Are you prepared for class? Do you have your things organized? Um, do you ask for permission to go to the bathroom? These are little things that I don't want to overlook. These are little things that are so important for being excellent. And there are a million little things, but pick three. Pick three that you want to really do well this week and work on those every single day. So how can you do the little things well? That's all for this session. Have a great rest of the week. Come to school every week and win free breakfast and the attendance trophy starting Monday, February 7th. Winners announced every Friday. Come to school every day in February and you could win big. Movie tickets, cash prizes, lunch, gift cards, and so much more.